The word is but. Marm quince malade. And it's spelt R E A L M A D A M. A kind of thick, thick very cooking sweet oil. paste or, or gel made from boiled up butts and sugar and sometimes cheese and cheese and oranges, lemons, limes, grapefruits, Paddington Bear, British colonialists, the Portuguese, Brazilians, the sort of stuffy English middle class. You wouldn't want to peel this and separate the segments and eat them. Marmalade is made from the whole of Britain. It is completely inedible. It's very tough and it's very bitter. And the juice is a bit sexy. It's almost impossible to, to eat it so... Sexy. That's enough. One day I was eating the lollipop. Oh, it was lovely. The juice jumps into my mouth. Nice. Then suddenly one day, oh no, it melted. Yes. So I went to the fridge. So our teacher head in there. Then I said, how come my lollipop melted? And yes, her eyes pop out. She bobs her head up and down. She said, that's enough. Then suddenly her head just fell over and died. Then I said, no, no. It was half past 12 and I had to get to Hollywood. I'm going to wet myself. And I cried. I had hoped that it wouldn't be necessary for me to take my teacher's head to Hollywood. Even as I speak. Would you believe it? My teacher breathing very, very quietly. I don't, I don't believe it. I really don't. Wonderful. She said, it isn't absolutely necessary for you to take me to Hollywood, is it? Then I said, I think it's tea time, bitch. So I sit down to eat her brains. She said, eating me is cruel. Eating me is murder. I can't stop myself. Oh no, it's all gone. When I was at Nose, we used to sit at desk lids. We used to slam a chocolate cake down. My teacher so us, and then we went home. Wonderful. When I was thick cooking oil, my mum stuffed a great big chunk of cheese in my granddad and he just fell over and died.